hello everyone welcome back to my channel so in this video i'm showing you guys how to cut and sew this stylish ankara top kindly subscribe but don't forget to like and leave a comment on the comment section Yes, so guys here the materials we'll be using in our video we have our two yard material and then we have our neckline piece so i cut the neckline piece in this shape triangular shape because i'm not using any drafting paper i'll just use the cloth what i'll do is to fold fold the the material like this so this upper part will be our neck, our shoulder line. And then I'll start measuring on the shoulder line. I'll measure three and a half, and then downwards I measure seven, seven inches. I join the two marks, the three and a half mark and the seven inches mark like this. And then I'll measure again five inches downwards from the seven inch. On the shoulder line, I measure five, five on both five and five. Then I join the five inches marks like this. Then I'll just go ahead and cut out the the mark lines after I'm done guys this is what we have for the front neckline and that's it facing and for the uh, our Ankara material here is what we have. I've folded it into two and I'll refold it again so in total we'll have four folds. I'll measure. I want to make a circular. That's the normal circular. So for this I use 23 inches. Because it's a top all round. I measure 23 inches all round. And then after that what i'll do is to cut out on the outline like this after that guys our neckline piece we put it on top of our fabric i'm making sure everything is aligned and then i'll trace out the, the i'll trace out our neckline piece after tracing it out I'll again add half an inch on the mark on the line for the sewing allowance then I'll cut it out because I'll, I want to replace it with the red neckline piece and here is what we have after cutting that out the next thing we'll do is now to separate the shoulders you want the front part and the back part separately and that's what we do and now we have the front part and the back part now this is our neckline piece i'll just stitch it with its facing on the v part and then top stitch again on the on the facing and what i've just done guys i have stitched the front neckline piece with their facing for both the front and the back part like this 
and I've held them already so I'll just go ahead and make a notch at the center of the top what I'll do next is to pin the neckline piece I'll pin it on the fabric all round yeah guys and I'll do the same for the left part too after pinning it down this is what we have so I'll just go ahead on my sewing machine and sew it and here is what we have after sewing it I sewed the neckline piece on the fabric like this both the front part and the back part now let's join our shoulders and after joining the shoulders I'll just go ahead and sew on the bottom part to make our work finish and yeah here is what we have guys after sewing on the shoulders I join the shoulders also stitch on the the, the the bottom part and we are done with our top guys kindly subscribe